Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Allah halal family Welcome to the channel I hope you guys are having yourself a wonderful day In today's video guys We'll be reacting to Five mega projects that are taking place in Malaysia This video was uh, suggested by brother Amirul uh, Azim Termak I say thank you very much for taking the time To send me your recommendation and uh, suggestion The video is by Skyscrapers MYY And the link is in the description In case you guys wanted to uh, check it out So inshallah we'll get started with the video in just a couple of uh, seconds And at the end of the video I'll share with you guys my observation and reaction So if you want to see them then please until uh, the end of uh, the video with us and now let's get started Marshall is good this video has English subtitles so I'll have it on but most likely you guys might not uh, see it because it's part of YouTube and not the video itself Negeri di bawah bayu dan bumi kenyalang ini Menyaksikan pembangunan pesat Projek-projek negara yang akan dan sedang Oh, was that? That was pretty cool Kali ini, kami mempersembahkan Lima projek mega berbilion ringgit Sabah dan Sarawak Dan Sabah dan Sarawak Lima ERP Sarawak Autonomous Rapid Transit Autonomous Rapid Ialah sistem pengangkutan awam baru Yang akan dibina di Bandar Raya Kuching, Sarawak That's cool Untuk mengurangkan kesesakan lalu lintas Yang semakin meningkat ERT Sarawak ini Bakal menjadi sistem trade ERT Yang pertama di Malaysia wow, so. Dan sistem transit pertama di Pulau Borneo Penjajarannya dijangka sepanjang Kuching ke Samarahan Dan stesen utama That's cool I don't think I've even heard Kuching. of or seen anywhere That has like Walaupun an automated uh, transit system Dia bergerak menggunakan tayar di atas jalan raya Bukannya di atas rail BRT mempunyai teknologi yang membolehkannya membaca tanda Like you, you know to have sky trains but not like buses Which would be pretty cool to see sejam Dan mampu membawa maksima sehingga 5 gerabak Kapasitinya mencapai 400 orang penumpang 400 passengers at time also that's pretty big 2023 not too far along from now Sepenuhnya menjelang 2025 Empat KK Resort City Wow KK Resort City ialah hub pelancongan dan komersial Yang bakal dibangunkan di sebuah pulau reklamasi Yang terletak di Meruntung Lok Kawi Di mana jaraknya hanya 15 km Dari selatan kota Kinabalu Sabah I love palm trees, guys. Mr. B is the best. Oh, wow, what a beautiful concept. Five billion. KK Resort City ini telah dilancarkan pada Mei 2019 yang lalu dan pembinaannya dijangka siap dalam tempoh 3 ke 4 tahun So by around 2022-2023 insyaAllah Hak Petrokimia Bintulu Petrochemical Sarawak, selaku negeri yang paling kaya dengan gas asli di Malaysia bakal membangunkan sebuah hak petrokimia di Tanjung Kidurong Bintulu Mungkin ada yang tertanya-tanya benda lah apa petrokimia tu? Petrochemistry Petrokimia ialah industri yang menghasilkan produk daripada petroleum dan gas asli. Contoh produk hasil petrokimia ialah hmm. cair, beg plastik dan sabun. Sabun. Sabun di bilik mandi. Sabun. We call it sabun to university. Sabun ini akan dibangunkan oleh kerajaan Sarawak yang mendapatkan sabun as well. Di pelabu antarabangsa. Setakat ini, Tapak pembinaan logi metanol sedang dipersiapkan di atas tapak hub 1000 ekar tersebut dengan kos 3.7 bilion. Projek industri petrokimia ini dijangka mewujudkan 74,000 wow, so jobs. Ia menyumbang 16 bilion hingga 20 bilion ringgit KBNK setahun kepada Sarawak. Number two, Jasper Water Fun another beautiful resort. Jasper Water Fun City merupakan sebuah projek master plan yang bertujuan untuk mentransformasi oh, tempat masyarakat pelabuhan lama pinggiran utara kota Kitabalu Sabah menjadi sebuah bandar tepian air moden dengan terminal feri dan terminal kapal pesiaran wow. antarabangsa. Keseluruhan pembangunan Jasper Water Fun City ini melibatkan gabungan projek-projek seperti One Jasper Water Fun, Jasper Key. Buildings so unique looking. Convention City, Sabah International Convention Center, Jasper Point Ferry Terminal, dan International Cruise Terminal. Keseluruhan pembangunan ini bersiap dalam anywhere close to what they're going to be developing it to. 
Okay, so then, the city, pasti dia akan menjadikan kota Jawa sebagai buildings and malls yang paling menarik dan wajib untuk dikunjungi di Asia Tenggara. And number one, Luburayu or New Highway. Luburayu Pen Borneo merupakan antara projek infrastruktur terbesar negara yang akan merapatkan jurang kawasan pedalaman dengan kawasan bandar di Sabah dan Sarawak. Nice. Istimewanya Lebuh Raya Pen Borneo ini berbanding dengan Lebuh Raya di Semenanjung Malaysia, Lebuh Raya ini tidak mempunyai itul. Penjajarannya adalah sepanjang 2,239 km. 2,239 km. Wow. Ini dibahagikan kepada Seksyen Sabah dan Seksyen Sarawak. Setakat Ogos 2020, Seksyen Sabah sudah 36% siap dan dijadualkan siap sepanjang. Over the next three to four years, and so getting done. Sepenuhnya pada pertengahan 2022. Dengan lebuh raya ini, warga Sabah dan Sarawak akan dapat menikmati perjalanan di dalam dan di antara negeri dengan lebih selamat dan selesa, selain membawa pembangunan dan peluang ekonomi kepada kawasan yang dihubungkan. Really cool guys, Masha, there's a lot of cool uh, projects that are taking place, some cool resorts, like two of them, and then the best, I guess they saved it for uh, last, which was the highway, it's going to be uh, running through the two uh, states. It's awesome to see because the more development that will take place, inshallah, the more tourists it'll bring, and at the same time, it'll uh, help with the local economy of the cities, the regions that it yeah, you know, those development will take place. For example, the petrochemistry or petrochemical plan that they were going to be building it said is going to create 74,000 uh, jobs and uh, you know the highway for example will allow people to be able to travel between uh, different cities uh, uh, quicker and that's going to help with more development because more people are going to uh, live in other areas since there's going to be a highway that will allow them to travel and also more for example development will take place like they should right new uh, restaurants and uh, convenience stores and shop and superstores and and whatnot so it's uh, awesome for the country you know it, it makes me happy to see these kind of uh, development uh, take uh, place because it's going to help for example malaysia move forward right it's going to help its gdp grow and like i said more tourists uh, will come so it's awesome uh, to see you know i just wish that projects like this would take place in afghanistan too but always good to dream right so inshallah thank you very much guys for uh, suggesting this video i enjoyed it quite a bit and i can't wait inshallah to see these projects uh, complete and hope to visit uh, malaysia one day as i've said it in previous videos it is on my bucket list inshallah when the channel hits a million subscribers and we're getting close to it each day i'll be taking a trip over to uh, malaysia so if you haven't then please consider subscribing to the channel and help me reach my target faster and if you guys like this video please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe if you have any other videos for me to check out you can put your suggestions in the comment section as always thank you very much Shukran. merci guys for all your love and support i hope you guys have yourself a wonderful day take care of yourself and your family inshallah i'll see you guys in the next video take care